Well, today we're going to paint another Star Trek Mego figure. So do you remember, I don't know if you watched my previous video, but I had a Mego Kirk and I thought, I got a spare one, I'll try and paint him up. See if you can get him to look a bit more like Shatner. I don't know whether I succeeded, probably not. But then at a recent convention, for a couple of quid, I picked up a Scotty. So this is a spare Scotty. He is absolutely grimy in the groin. What's been going on? So, yeah, not a bad likeness. So we're going to try and paint him and see how he comes out. So let's put Kirk to one side. So we're going to do use our usual flesh mix, which is a mix of Cadian Citadel layer Cadian flesh tones and some Vallejo light flesh. And then we're just going to give him a coat over the flesh colour with that. I'm just going to paint all over. Be careful around neck because you can't get the heads off these figures easily. So I'll probably switch to a smaller brush to do the flesh around the neck. But you can see how that's going. So I'm going to give several coats and we'll come back and start shading. Okay, so I've put a couple of coats on. You can see it's actually a Pretty good likeness of uh, James Doohan. It's not from front on, but certainly from sort of three quarter. So what we're going to do is use my normal uh, shading material, which is Reichland Flesh Shade. So I'm going to use that and just run that in. that dry and then we'll come back and blend it in okay so the flesh is blended in the flesh wash so what I'm going to do now is add a bit of white to the the eyes and for that I'm going to use Corex white is moustache. I'm just going to use a bad and black for his moustache and hair. Okay, so I'm going to do his hair and then we'll come back and do the eyes. Okay, so Hair's dry, so what I'm going to do now is paint in two blue eyeballs. Okay, and I also need to do is lip colour, so I'm going to mix a bit of red with a bit of the flesh. Okay. And while I've got the flesh out, I can tidy his eye up. And then I'm going to use black just to do a line above the eye. I'm not sure I can do the pupil at this scale because I think it will cover up the blue, but we'll give it a go. Okay, I'm going to have to repaint that eye because my board just moved. Do this eye. That does happen. one eye done and all his bloggy eye so I'm going to repaint that other eye and we'll come back do a bit of dry brushing on the hair and then he should be almost about done okay so I finished Scotty so as you can see this one is one of my original ones is quite pale but you can see the difference it brings it makes it look much more like James do and it's actually a really nice sculpt um, so all I did on the uniform was touch up some of the parts um, touched up the belt buckle touched up the badge so yeah I'm really pleased with that so now we've got a painted Kirk and Spock original Kirk and Spock I think they look pretty good so thanks for watching if you want to see more of these figures let me know i've got a spock somewhere so i might give him a go 
and uh, please like and subscribe and uh, any comments uh, in the comment section below thanks then bye